Hillbilly DVD Reviews Unboxing Series. Today we got a rare treat for you. Going out again with the Twilight Time Series. We got the limited edition. John Carpenter's Christine. You're going to say, this is an unboxing video, but how is unboxing? There's no shrink wrap and shit on it. Well, it is brand new, and I'll get to that in a second here, motherfuckers. Didn't come with any shrink wrap on it, but there was a reason. All right. Twilight Time, most of you fuckers in the comments are going to talk about how you hate them and shit. I understand, man. Like, sometimes you get burned on their releases. You can't get them, and fuckers are selling them on eBay. That actually happened to me with Christine. You know, they announced the movie nine months ago. Great, great, great. And then I did not keep up with it. They didn't send me an email. You know, you just got to know when the shit's coming out. It came out. Unfortunately, you know, I didn't get to it. Sold out in six hours, seven hours, whatever you say. Just so, you know, fuckers could go scalp it. And they scalped it galore. But what happened was... About a month after they all sold out, they announced like, hey, we're going to do this sale on Twilight Time. If you buy $100 worth of other movies that we got, we'll throw in a free Christine, and it'll be autographed by Keith Gordon, the main actor in the movie. So this is the edition I got. I got it's kind of good that I got burned because I ended up getting a fucking autograph edition. So no shrink wrap duties to go. They got a nice artwork here. A lot of people did not like the artwork that they come up with for uh, Night of the Living Dead. They did brand new artwork. This one they kind of did what was similar on a previous DVD release. I guess they learned a lesson. Fuckers gonna be picky. You got the typical Twilight Time spine, which is just a fucking you know black with a white you know print of the movie's name and shit. On the back, you got the description of the movie and shit. They got the special features. This one includes isolated score track, audio commentary with John Carver, Keith Gordon, Fast and Furious as a feature at Finish Light Ignition, delete alternate scenes. Twilight Time is basically just a licensing company, so all these, you know, fucking special features came from Sony. I guess they're on a previous DVD or some shit. So there you go. Let's pop it open, see what the inside's like. First of all, what makes this edition special is the booklet. And this is gonna be real tiny because the signature's real tiny, but this is where Keith Gordon signed it. And the reason I loved it that Keith Gordon signed it was because I'm a big f he he acts in this movie, but I'm a big fan of also his directorial work. He directed this movie Chocolate War. I love it, one of my favorite movies of all fucking time. Christine, aside from maybe Back to School with Rodney Dangerfield, was his last major motion picture. He quit acting like a few years after this just to fucking go on and do the directing shit. So yeah, fucking awesome, man. Keith Gordon signed this shit. I love it. Uh, from what I understood, there was only 100 signed copies out there. So, you know, when they had that little refresh flash sale, they sold off like a few regular shrink wrap copies for 30 bucks. Those sold out in like two seconds. If you were willing to pay 100 bucks, man, you got the signed copy. Very fucking cool. Got nice, really nice uh, laid out artwork. I mean, I liked all the little booklets that come with all the previous Twilight Time releases, but I think this one's even fucking better. And last but not least, we had the disc itself going with the artwork. Very cool. I have not watched this disc yet, but I want to watch it in the next couple days and get a review out to you guys very fucking soon. So keep appealing. Twilight Time, man, it's controversial, whatever, but it's always, you know, when we cover these movies, these releases, always one of our best, most viewed, whatever fucking videos. So, yeah, Twilight Time, love it or hate it. Hillbilly DVD Reviews got to pay the rent, so we're going to be covering this shit.